is I like to start this event with a little open mic session where people pitch me or ask me a question. And then in uh, my trademark candid style, I savage them for the entertainment of the audience. <laughs> These people have all agreed to take the red pill in advance. There's no blue pill in here. These folks have said, I am going to pitch you and I want you to give me your God's honest truth, uh, the honest reaction. Okay, so who's first? All right, look at this guy. Oof, got the tie and everything. This can be a round of applause. Why don't you grab one of those microphones? Okay, and uh, tell us your name. Check. Kevin Gillespie, text the lawyer. Uh, where are you from? Portland, Oregon. All right, I like a guy in a suit, looking good. All right, you have one minute on the clock to either pitch, you're going to pitch your company? Definitely. Okay, and you, you have taken the red pill? Two of them. Good. <laughs> Three, two, go. Ever gotten a ticket you thought was bullshit? Or a family member got arrested and you wondered, what's next? If you didn't know how to get quick and affordable legal advice, you're not alone. According to justice.gov, 80% of all legal need goes unmet, a $300 billion market currently being ignored. Our target market is people who have trouble connecting to an attorney. These people uh, have trouble because they find lawyers expensive, difficult to contact, and the legal process intimidating. Our solution, text a lawyer. We are the world's fastest way to hire an attorney because we simplify the process. Download our app, pick a state, choose a legal category, and you're automatically connected to the highest rated attorney. Pricing is fixed. $20 to hire a lawyer for a quick chat. $9 for follow-up questions. Apps are ready for launch. The right lawyer, right now. All right, let's give him a big round of applause. <laughs> Clearly, somebody has been practicing their pitch. That was exceptionally well done. And the first thing that's important to understand when you're pitching, especially in this kind of format, is you want people to understand what you do. And you did an excellent job of that. You presented the problem. There's a large group of people who don't know how to find a lawyer. And um, we have a solution. Text a lawyer. The name says what it is. And you actually mentioned the price. So you preempted a lot of my questions. Because most of the time when I talk to an aspiring founder or a founder, I just sit there and wait as they do things like say, let me set the table. Let me frame the discussion. And it's just like, who has time for all this? I don't need your backstory. I don't need to know anything other than what does this product do in the world? Why did you build it? How does it make money? Let's start with the most important thing. So what I love about your presentation, tell me your first name again. Kevin. And where are you from again? Portland. Kevin from Portland. This is a, a great pitch. Just great that you were the first person to pitch because there was, it was so clear. Who doesn't understand this business? Raise your hand. Great. That is success, right? That's success. So now that get you to the next phase with an investor. What you're trying to do in a format like this is get the meeting. And you're trying to build credibility. We are all in a giant credibility uh, contest called life. Right? And your credibility Indeed. went like this. In one minute. Serious guy, tight haircut, great suit, takes the job seriously, obviously didn't come up here unprepared. And in under a minute, we know what you do, we know how you make money. Credibility went like this. Now you get the second meeting. You got a second meeting with me if you want it, because I want to know. Yes, please. Okay, and I want to know <laughs> how much money does this make, right? And what is the margin? And that's when you know you've got them on the hook, the investors. The number one question I get is how do I get investor money uh, or how do I get your money? And really, we have too many companies to go through. And in this credibility exercise, we want to work with people as investors who we feel are going to be easy, breezy, and who are focused. You didn't leave anything to our imagination. We don't got to figure out anything with this business. Young people, people maybe who are in the lower third of the demographic, don't have desktop computers. Maybe they skip desktop computers. They just have a phone. Maybe they're comfortable in text but not on the phone. All these reasons we know text works. So it just a lot of checkboxes went off. Let's give them a big round of applause. Thank you.